Hi guys, it's me. And you might be wondering, why in the world is my table blank and not so attractive and slightly off-centered? Well, it's because today I am going to be working with Elmer's Glue Unicorn Dream. Now, this is something that Elmer's has started doing. I'm not sure how long they've been doing it, but they have been making slime out of their own glue and they put texture in it and they make it scented and it's all sorts of fun. I actually have one over here and it is their Fruity Slushy. Now you can tell I have been using this one for a very long time because it's actually like lowering down. I think it's just from where I'm using it. And just to kind of give you an idea of what I'm doing, I'll show you what it is, just in case you don't know what it is. So it has been settled a while, so the texture has kind of come up to the top, but you kind of just, it's slime. But enough with me playing with this. That is not what the video is about. I enjoyed this stuff a lot. And so I went to Walmart and saw this for 13 bucks. And I'm just gonna go ahead and dig right into it. I am most interested in the butter slime because I have started seeing stuff about butter slime and I'm interested to try it. So that's the main reason why I bought this. So over here we have some yellow unicorn magic slime. This one is supposed to include some gold foil, according to the package. And so it's supposed to be like the unicorn horn, like the shiny horn that a unicorn has. And so on top, it's supposed to have whatever you're supposed to use in it. This one is the unicorn butter and it has pink clay in the top and it's supposed to make butter slime. And if I'm not mistaken, that kind of means it has like a buttery texture and I like crunchy slime. And so I kind of like different textures of slime. So I'm figuring that this one's gonna be my favorite. And then this one is unicorn fluffy. It's a blue slime and it comes with unicorn confetti and it's just supposed to be sparkly. I think I should just start with this one. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> it just fell apart my fingers okay so i guess i need to go ahead and open this up because i'm figuring that if this stuff falls apart like that i just need to go ahead and put it into the slime as i go so ooh. oh that's a very ooh, different it's in my makeup <gasps> it smells like bananas this is why I love this stuff. Oh man, that is nice. It's a very different texture than my fruity slushy one. So I'm just gonna flatten it out so that I can add the foil into it. Oh, see, it's so easy to fall apart. Oh, it's sticking to me. <laughs> oh no. I was just thinking I would break it off over top of it. So maybe... Okay, so that's one package of it, because it's all packaged up. That must be why, because it just falls right apart. Yeah. Wow. Feels like very thin wrapping paper. Ooh, 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 it's breaking it. Oh, it's sticking right to me. Oh no. Oh gosh. We're just gonna ignore my fingers at the moment and keep playing. That's pretty. Yeah, I like this. I can see why they chose this really um, dark yellow now because it kind of goes with it once you look at it. Okay, I washed my hands because I had foil all over them. So I just kind of let it sit out. Just click it. 
and then I'm gonna roll it. Okay, so it does come off in my hands just a little. Let's put it back in its container. Kind of curious to see if the oil will come to the top like the one. Okay, next I'm gonna be doing the blue one, the unicorn fluffy, which this one was the confetti style. Ooh, I think this is really pretty. And they're just shaped like little unicorns. Okay, so it's scented, but it doesn't tell you what scent it is. I wish it did, but that's okay. I think it's blueberry. I really like the color of this one. Okay. This is really pretty. I like how it, and they shine rainbow. Okay, so I'm just gonna it over it kind of looks like a bob from monsters vs. aliens oh, that sounds really cool okay so since there's really nothing else i can do for this one i'm just gonna put it in its container and now for what i think is gonna be my favorite Unicorn butter. It comes clear, but you make it pink. And I think that's gonna be interesting to do. <gasps> it's like bubble gum. <gasps> I don't know how to explain this. I think it's scented, but I'm confusing myself because I can't tell if it's my own fingers or if it's plastic scent. <laughs> so, this stuff, very stretchy. Like, it almost feels like silly putty, but see, it's not the same as regular clay. I don't know what kind of clay it would be. Like, if it, I feel like if this dried, it would still be squishy in a way. But there's that little ball, and it's light and bouncy. <gasps> Looks like glass. I guess we'll do it like I've done the others. I'll just put it in there and roll it around and make it pretty. This one's actually, in my opinion, probably going to be the most satisfying because you just mix it all in. And then you get to see it mix in, kind of swirly almost is what I think it's gonna be. Okay. Oh, that was nice. Press that on there. And go for it. Yeah, this is my favorite. Donut. Kinda looks like another scrunchie. All right, so overall, this kit was awesome. I would totally recommend it if you love slime or if you're interested in unicorn stuff. Again, this is Elmer's Glue Unicorn Dream. Here it is. Here is what you get. I'm sure you could mix the two, you know, if you wanted to put the confetti in this one, the foil in this one, you know, you could do that. But I went totally by the instructions, did exactly what it wanted me to do. And I am pleased. I was right. This one is my favorite. It's totally my favorite. It was super satisfying to make. The process was very satisfying. This one has to be my second because I just really like how the sparkles turned out in the slime. And the reason this one is my least favorite is just because the color isn't as appetizing 
I think my main issue with it though is the fact that the foil comes out and it gets on your hands and it sticks to your hands. It doesn't just get on your hands, you knock it off. It stays unless you rinse it off or you wipe it off a lot. The gold is very pretty in it. It just goes very well with the yellow, even though I would have much rather preferred a lighter yellow. That's all I have for you guys today, and I will see you guys next week. Stay happy, stay sweet, be awesome!